Hi, I'm Ryan and I hope you're having a great day. In this video, I want to show you how to snap objects using Inkscape. So let's get started. Let's say I have these two rectangles here and I've given them a little bit of a stroke so that you can easily see things when I snap them. In order to snap things in Inkscape, you don't need to select any object, but what you need to do instead is enable snapping by clicking on this button here on the right hand side. This is the snapping toolbar. What I would that's I guess what that's what it's called. So if you click on this button, you see a couple of options become enabled for you. Because these are objects, so you're gonna have to click on this button here which reads snap bounding boxes. So if you click on this, you have a few more options enabled here. And if you just look at these icons here, you can almost tell what they do. For example, if you click on this icon which says Snap to Bounding Box Corners, this is active now and now if I move this box around, notice how it tries to snap to the corner. So Every corner snaps to the other corner and this way I can you know, neatly align my bo boxes with each other. The other option I want to show you is uh, this one which just has the edges. It reads snap to the edges of a bounding box but when you click on it for some reason it doesn't snap to the edges. And I'm going to show you how to make that work. Let's look at the next option which is the snap to midpoints of bounding boxes. So if you click on this button now the midpoint of this box or the edge of the mid midpoint of the edge of this box, which might be this or this edge, is going to try to snap to the midpoint of the edge of the other box. Notice how these midpoints align. If I try to snap it here, it doesn't, right? But if I go close here, I suddenly get this prompt. The interesting thing now that I want to show you is if you enable this along with this, which is the edges, now you would be able to snap to any edge that you want to. So that's exactly how you want to use this this option. Use this snap to edges with bounding box along with the midpoints of the bounding box. The next remaining option is the midpoints. So if it reads snapping centers of bounding boxes, what it means is it's going to snap to the center. Notice how when I moved it to the center, it was able to snap to the middle of it. And that pretty much covers all the snapping options for boxes. I'll c cover most stuff uh, related to parts in one of the future videos. Uh, it will also have some parts related to boxes as well. And yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.